boys and, and girls friends. and friends and lovers <laughs> and mothers it's grocery day and it's really rainy outside and Kyle said he was a ninja when he ran to the car because he didn't get any water on him not one but drop I don't believe him except for the ones on my shirt <laughs> groceries today we're getting a lot of similar things but we have a surprise grocery haul for you at the end of this video along with our normal grocery haul and also we're getting a couple new things we decided to change our diet up just a little bit to try to lose a little bit more body fat so we took out some of the processed fats that we use like the light mayo and the peanut butter and we decided to instead of put mayo in our tuna we've been doing salsa so we're gonna probably get a salsa at night instead of peanut butter we've been doing sugar low sugar um, strawberry jam and we got one of those but if I see another one today for a good price I'll probably pick one of those up and then show you guys what the container looks like. Yep, and hopefully it stops raining by the time we get to the grocery store because I can't mess up this pretty hair. <laughs> if not, I'm covering my head with these, <laughs> with bags. <laughs> okay, see you when we're out. All right, we're back. So, treat day milk like usual, 2% yep. for cereal. This is the salsa that we have been putting a tablespoon in our tuna. It's the Great Value Hot Thick and Chunky, and it's really good. Got three pepper hots. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, this, hey, this week we decided, we seen they have unsweetened vanilla cashew milk. Now the almond vanilla unsweetened doesn't really, there's no difference, but we figured we'd try it. So we got two original unsweetened and then two vanilla unsweetened. So we'll try those out. Um, we got our normal cottage cheese for our nighttime snack. 1%. Yep, our 1%. We got our normal fat-free plain Greek yogurt. We are getting low on Splenda, so we got the great value kind. It's the same thing. Um, we get the no-name crisp rice cereal for our post-workout meals. Um, here is all our tuna. We like the Chunk Light Skipjack tuna from Great Value. And green beans. And the lovely jello flavors of the week. The no sugar. We got cherry, lime, raspberry, and strawberry. Mm. Banana to go in our post-workout protein shake. They're and not in pajamas. No, they're not in pajamas, which is sad, but they will be in our protein shake. Um, I like to put this when I make protein pancakes for a change during the week instead of egg whites. Um, I, I make, I put an unsweetened applesauce on top. And the on sale pop tarts, we chose frosted confetti cupcake, which are amazing. And well, of course, when it says birthday edition, you have to get them in case they go away. In case and, you might have a birthday. Yeah. And when they say limited edition, they might go away. So you've got to get frosted hot fudge sundae. Now we've had both those kinds before and they're amazing. And then we got seven cucumbers because we split one each day to eat with our tuna. So this cut in half, me eat one, Kylie one, like that. <laughs> so, oh yeah. And, uh, this baby right here, it doesn't look like I used it right now because my hair is rain hair. But this is, it used to be called Finishing Cream. Now it's called Secret Weapon Touch-Up Cream by John Frieda. And it has avocado oil in it. Um, I like to put it on my hair after I straighten it to tame all the little like frizzy pieces that, that fly up. It works really good and my hair gets greasy with some products and this does not make it greasy. You just put a little bit on. So... Good product if you're looking for something like that. Not so secret anymore, are you? And buddy? for Mr. Fancy Hair, he uses this. Got to be glued. 
And it literally looks like, like the white pasty glue. And he can go through the rain and his hair still stays. <laughs> and I got these. I get these alcohol swabs at Walmart for $2. When I, I do my own manicures and pedicures, and I always put cuticle oil on after. These are awesome for wiping the cuticle oil off and keeping the nail bed clean so you can put nail polish on without any gunk underneath. So, yeah. Okay, and now we will be back with the grand surprise haul. Oh, look at that. Whoa. Here's the secret haul. Okay, this is the secret haul. My friend went to the States and she always asked us if there's anything that we would like her to pick up for us. So she surprised us and bought us, so she knows she, that we love them. She bought us another bag of flaming Hot Crunchy Cheetos. And we are excited because we love them. She said she knows we like hot stuff, so she thought we'd like to try these. So she got us these bacon habanero tortilla chips. Late, Ju late July. Yeah, I've never heard of that uh, company, but they look awesome and they're two of our favorite things, bacon and hot. Yeah, so if anyone's ever, I'm gonna squimp over here. <laughs> if anyone's ever heard of this brand or had it, let us know what you think of these if yeah. you tried them. Um, and then we asked her for these, if she could grab us these, um, peanut butter cream Oreos. Mm. Oh my goodness, I can't wait to eat those. Double chocolate crave. So we get normal crave here, um, but we had double chocolate crave and then it went away. So we asked to try that out because the normal crave is amazing. You know who you blame for that? Canada. Silly Canada. So fruity pebbles and cocoa pebbles, of course. These are my ultimate, all time, forever favorite cereals. And I really like the Cocoa Pebbles. I'm not a big fruity cereal person, but I'm going to give them another try because sometimes I try them and I say no, but then I give it another try and then I like it. Uh, cinnamon Roll Pop-Tarts, which I'm really excited to try. Oh my. Yeah. And these, look at these, limited edition chocolatey strawberry Pop-Tarts. I think these are going to be really good. And then brown sugar cinnamon mm. pop tarts. Yeah, I think these are going to be really good. Oh yeah. Yeah, I do. I really think so. I, I think they're all going to be awesome. Oh yeah. And this is not part of the haul, but I found this at Zares the other day, and just up until like two days ago, you could only get chocolate checks in the states. So when I seen that in the store. It was on sale. It wasn't a great sale. It was $4, but it was worth it because when you see things that come from the States that we don't get here, you get them. Come on, Canada. You can do yeah. it. Don't be afraid. So, Me and Nicole will support the whole food industry by ourselves. Mm -hmm. Look <laughs> at this. Chocolate checks. Yep. So, yeah, there's all of that. And then our Jello is in 100% set. So we can't put the Cool Whip on it for you, but I will show you what Yeah, we'll just show you. Look at that fancy glass. Ooh. So that's what it looks like, and then we're gonna top it with this. Now in the States, I think you guys get fat-free Cool Whip, but we don't, we only get the light. So this is the light Cool Whip, and for three tablespoons, it's 30 calories, four carbs, two sugar, and two fat. We're eating so that's a fancy dessert tonight. Fancy dessert. And one more thing before we go, I wanted to show you that jam that I was talking about. We didn't get another one because this one's full, but I wanted to show you what it looks like. That's my jam. <laughs> I was kind of scared of what was going to be said there. <laughs> so this is the jam. It is Smucker's No Sugar Added Strawberry. We were... We did get some from the States last time sugar-free, but we don't get sugar-free here, so this is the best. And I'll tell you about the macros. For one tablespoon, it's 20 calories, five carbs, and four sugar, but we only use half a tablespoon, so it's only two sugar and like two and a half carbs. So it's pretty good, and, and 10 it calories. makes cottage cheese really tasty. Yes, and when you put protein powder in with it, peanut butter flavored protein powder. Mm. It tastes like peanut butter and jam cottage cheese. It's actually quite good. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to check us out on Instagram. 
and never do this. Okay? Don't. Don't ever forget to like and subscribe. Or else, what about it? <laughs> My fist of doom. Boom. Bye. Bye, guys. Bye, friends.